Hello. <laughs> Today we're going to do a get ready with me for a girls date. My dear mother is coming over in a really short amount of time. <laughs> we need to hurry up and get ready. Hey dude, what are you up to, huh? This is going to be the least glamorous get ready with me ever. I've just got some old makeup. It's not looking cute. I don't even want to show you my makeup bag. It's bad. My foundation that I usually wear is this from NYX Born to Glow. Yeah. Let's do some speed getting ready together. It's like speed dating. Who else used to sit right in front of the mirror every day getting ready? for high school. Sitting down in front of a tall mirror to get ready is a vibe, I think. It's kind of fun. <laughs> the next thing I use is just a Revlon. I don't know, I really just use anything that I find in my old makeup collection. Revlon Photo Ready Candid. This is like the lightest color ever. It's not even the right color, but whatever. And then this really old blush from Maybelline. Maybelline Fix. Oh, I thought it said Fix Me. <laughs> Maybelline, can you fix me? I know you're not really supposed to use your fingers whenever you're putting on makeup. And I try not to. You know what? I can just use the camera. I got a new camera recently. And then <laughs> I put on this from Rare Beauty. It's so old that the actual name of it has worn off. Mesmerize Liquid Luminance Luminizer. <laughs> I need to get more Rare Beauty stuff because I really loved the foundation from Rare Beauty. I really, really loved that foundation. It's like the best working foundation ever. I'm not a makeup person. Kind of just find a conglomerate of makeup that works and I just I stick to it. This I found at TJ Maxx for $3, I think. <laughs> Perfect colors, 12, 12. <laughs> And you can see I've mostly just used the top two right there. I use this lighter one as just kind of like a highlighter base. And then I put this one in the crease. Yeah, my mom's coming over. <laughs> I <feel weird. laughs> I do have a mini mirror. This is better. My mom is coming over. We're gonna have a girl's day. We've got this favorite, favorite spot and they play music all the time. I don't think they're gonna play music while we're there, unfortunately, but oh well. And it's a seafood place. We get raw oysters. Y'all, raw oysters sound disgusting. Whenever I was a kid, they were disgusting, but whenever you're sitting outside by the actual salt water, my gosh, raw oysters are the way to go. We're gonna party and then we're gonna watch The Golden Bachelor afterwards. And my mom's birthday is coming up. So I got her a little gift that I really need to wrap before she gets here. I was editing a video and I kind of got lost in it and I took way more time than I should have and suddenly I am sitting here <laughs> getting ready for y'all because I knew I wanted to do one of these little get ready with me videos. I guess I'll just call this one an unhinged one because like, I don't know, I'm going really fast. Um, the next thing that I use is <laughs> this thing from NYX, this jumbo stick. Uh, the lid keeps falling off. It didn't come with that much. I kind of just got this to do my eyebrows. So what I'm doing is I'm dipping this in there. This. This is so gross. Y'all, I don't... I feel like a teenager again. Like, I used to do this stuff all the time when I was a teenager. I literally, one time in the comments area of my high school, I found, like, a makeup brush. And that became my makeup brush. This is so nasty. That became my makeup brush until I was in college. I just don't really spend that much on makeup stuff. I almost just didn't do the other eyebrow. Oh my gosh. What am I gonna be looking like at the restaurant? Okay, I'm actually almost done. This is literally all I do and then I put on some eyeliner. I will try to do it as close as possible to the camera because I must say, being an emo gal most of my life, I am pretty good with this liquid liner. This is probably my favorite I've ever used. This is just Sephora brand, Fine Line Felt Liner. This is my favorite thing to use. It doesn't like give you weird creases right here and it goes on pretty easy. I start from the corner out and then I just kind of do it. I like make myself just do it, you know? And then I fill in the rest. The second eye is way harder because it's my right hand, but sometimes it works out, so let's see. 
Okay. And then I just like fill it in. Yeah, so I start from the corner and then I just like quickly just like go in. Draw the cat as sharp enough to kill a man. Um, yeah, last step for my makeup is just some mascara. I have used the CoverGirl Clump Crusher. It's a green bottle for forever. It's the same as the one in the purple bottle, but it's $1 cheaper just because the, the brush is like a little bit different, I think. Like it has less brush to it, but all you need is one side of your brush. Like, I don't care. It's like a dollar cheaper, y'all. It's a dollar cheaper. And this mascara is uh, my go-to. Sticking with that story. Yeah, holy crap. I don't know where my mom is. I feel like she's about to walk in the door at any second. I will show y'all the final product. All I have to do is my hair and throw on some kind of clothes that are appropriate for like the fall season. I might wear something from my latest fall, cozy fall girl outfits video. I'm kind of feeling like I might do that. Okay, I'll see you in a sec. <laughs> Okay, what do you want me to film? I'll Look go how back in a second. Beautiful you are. <laughs> Here's the final product. My dear mother is here. She is filming. She is my hype woman. <laughs> she is rolling her eyes from from the other side of the camera. Here is <laughs> my outfit. I actually posted a video with this outfit in it, and I linked all the stuff. But I'll still link it below here. It's just like a simple fall outfit for a still hot day because we live in Louisiana and it is hot still. <laughs> so I've got a little Walmart tank top going on. I got this tank top a few years ago from Walmart. This denim over thing is from a big old thrift pile, a thrift $5 pile, <laughs> but it's actually Ralph Lauren. So $5 Ralph Lauren, gotta go thrifting. <laughs> But my sandals that I usually wear are from Amazon. My jewels. I think this is from Dillard's. I don't know. But they were like a $40 little gold earring. I feel like these are perfect. They are perfection. This necklace. This right here. This very here necklace. <laughs> this necklace was from my dear, dear mother. It has an R on it because my name is... My name is Rachel. <laughs> my name is Rachel. <laughs> other necklace I stole from my mother. <laughs> this bracelet is from Nature's Jewelry and this ring is from Nature's it is a peri -dot. Jewelry. That is my birthstone. I was born in Augusta. I feel like some sort of an elven woman wearing it. <laughs> my mom just rolled her eyes like whatever. But speaking of jewelry, my mom needs to open her birthday gift. Oh, I could do that. <laughs> <laughs> Well, that's, that's, that's the best mukbang. 
mukbangs, mama. What do you call it? Mukbang? What, what, what is a mukbang? People call it different things. Muk, mukbang, mukbang, mukbang. Different things. M M U K. Muk. Muk. B A N G. Mukbang.